What does te postli mean in Nahuatl? This short video will comment on challenges the Eye of the Serpent channel must face on the language of the Aztecs from past to present. I took these photos at the National Museum of Natural History as they represent pieces of raw copper from North American sources, namely Michigan and Arizona. The earliest colonial sources on Nahuatl grammar have two basic meanings for tepostli. The first is workable metal, which would have included copper, tin, and other native materials. The second meaning specifies copper itself, the epitome of the general concept. These flattened copper knives, which would have been used as objects of exchange in Oaxaca, are examples of how copper served as a commonly worked metal in ancient Mesoamerica. They are in the National Museum of Anthropology, Mexico City. The colonial period imported foreign materials and technologies to New Spain, and they importantly included iron, an essential component of steel and other alloys. As they became more common in colonial life, tepostli would begin to shift its meaning toward them. And in the present day, many Nahuatl dialects say tepostli for modern metal tools, such as rifles and electronics, including the recording equipment I used while visiting their communities. I have typically avoided making videos where the word's meaning would be too complex to fit into a 10-second short. Instead, I prefer longer works to give these words the space they need for their dynamic nuances. We will have one more exploration of technology and the indigenous in our final installment of this National Museum of Natural History series. Join us for its conclusion with today's mask.